welcome to my channel how's it going i hope you're all doing really really well and i hope you all had a wonderful holiday festive christmas period whatever it is that you and your families celebrate i hope you had an awesome awesome time now this video is the what i got for christmas video if you don't like these kind of videos then please don't put yourself through watching it i know some people really don't like them and feel like it's a bragging video which it isn't at all i just want to share some of the things that I got for Christmas that just made me really, really happy. I wanted to share with you guys. If you don't like them, I'm not going to be offended at all if you don't watch that. It's perfectly fine, but I love watching these kind of videos. I've got Lightning Lass's one because she's just done one, which I'll link. And I'm going to go and watch that as soon as I finish filming this. I'm off to watch hers because I saw on her Instagram and I think she got the Jeffree Star Alien palette, which just is too exciting. So I want to show you. But if you like these kind of videos, please do give this one a thumbs up. You should definitely subscribe to my channel for more fun stuff to come. Uh, yeah, let's just jump in. This isn't everything I got. Some things I got um, don't fit or aren't that are going back, but I will explain about them. Some things are in the garden already because they're plants. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. So let's jump in and let me know what your favourite present was that you got. Comment down below because I love to know. So I'm going to start off with what... Ben got me, I think. Ben's stuff's over here. It's my first thing from Ben. It was these earrings. I'll try and zoom you in. They're magpies and they're like acrylic. He got them from Etsy. Anything I can link, I'll try and link for you guys. But yeah, he got me these earrings. And the significance for these is because when I was pregnant, both times with both girls, I saw magpies every single day. And it just felt, I don't know... I don't know, it just made me know that everyone was going to be okay with the pregnancies and I saw magpies all the time. Where we used to live in our house where the, both the girls were born, um, obviously they were born in hospitals, obviously, because those people have home births, but both my girls were born in hospital. But the house we lived in at the time, there was a family of magpies that lived in the tree in our garden and every single day I would see like six or seven and I have to say hello Mr Magpie every single time I see a magpie, even now the girls have started doing it as well. So yeah, that is the significance to those and I absolutely love them. They're so pretty. So yeah, that was my first present from Ben. He got me a jumper, um, like this kind of style jumper, like a nice, oh, a nice big baggy black jumper, but it had Figgy on it. And he got a little bit confused <laughs> with rappers because if you don't know, I absolutely love hip hop and rap. It is like... It just makes me happy in my soul, but I'm a Tupac fan. Now, I don't hate Biggie by any stretch of the imagination. If his music's on, I'll listen to it, but I wouldn't ever go, oh, I really want to listen to Biggie. And I think Ben just got a little bit confused, and he bought me this jumper, and it's a Biggie Christmas jumper, and I kind of said, I like it, but I'm not a fan of Biggie, so I wouldn't wear it. And that might sound ungrateful, but I'd rather he know, because it's an expensive jumper. I didn't see the point in me keeping a jumper that I'm never going to wear. So he is sending that back. Um, and it's quite funny because I had my Kings of Rap t-shirt on, which has got it's got Nas, Kanye, Jay-Z, Dre, Eminem, um, Ice Cube, Snoop, Tupac, and Biggie. It's nine rappers. And the only one I don't like is Biggie. And I sort of said to him, I was like, literally, the only reason I wear this t-shirt is because it's got all of my other favourite rappers on it. So I felt awful. I feel so, so bad. So bad. It's unbelievable. I had a little cry about how bad I felt. But I don't see the point in keeping a jumper that I'm never going to wear because it's expensive. So he is sending that back, bless him. But I do feel like an absolute horrible cow. Um, he's absolutely fine with it. He'd rather he sent it back and got me something that I did like. So I feel horrible. He, the next thing he got me was some Burt's Bees um, lip balm stuff. I got the Burt's Bees strawberry lip balm, which is just like an ordinary lip balm, which doesn't want to focus. And then he got me this stuff, which is an overnight intensive lip treatment. And he got me this because you, will, if you've watched any of my vlogs recently, you will know that I've had the most chapped lips ever. They've been so painful. And this stuff is, you can see I've already like used loads of it. It's so nice. It smells like peppermint. And it's helping my lips so, so much. So he got me those. Let me move. This is the box that Ben's presents came in. It's a, it's a unicorn Christmas box. So 
he got me this might seem a bit weird he got me a light to do gel nails because i will be doing a course hopefully in the new year if we can afford for me to do it a gel nail course camera thank you sort of um yeah so he got me a light for like to do gel nails so it's a put your hand in because he knows this, that's what I kind of want to do in the new year, just to earn a little bit of money. And it's something that I can do around the girls. So he got me that. He got me a number seven revitalizing hot cloth cleanser, which looks really interesting. I've not seen this before. And it is basically, it looks like a cleanser bottle. And then you get a cloth, like a, a towel in it as well. And I think you, what do you do? Uh, close your eyes, massage over dry skin, run the cloth under hot, under comfortably hot water, and then you place the cloth on your face to open the pores. After a few minutes, so you basically you put it on your face, and then you put the cloth on and just kind of relax for a few minutes, and it's just a really good cleanser. So I'm excited to try that. He got me a couple of bits from the sanctuary. He got me a moisture rich foot butter which smells incredible smells so so good it's like um what does it smell of doesn't does it say what it smells of yeah almond oil and aloe vera it just it's so so nice i'm excited to use it for the summer he got me a salt spray which is just a salt spray a salt um scrub which is separated so i need to give it a mix but that's a sanctuary one as well that is yeah just the salt scrub again this smells like coconut and jojoba it smells amazing so that is going straight upstairs in my bathroom he got me a skinny dip mil melon dollar baby feeling fizzy bath sherbet it's so cool look at this can and then inside like the top pops off Ooh. and then inside are these little sachets of bath sherbet i used one last night and they smell amazing really really lovely really nice and i hadn't seen that before but i thought it was a really cool and i can use the can and just have it in my background afterwards um he got me some underwear which i chose the savage fenty underwear now the bra is too big i tried it on and i i told him what size is to order um but the bra is just too big so i've got the pants i haven't tried these on yet but they look like they'll be fine because i got a big old ass um and I just got the black with the gold waistband. I just, they feel so soft. So, so soft. And what is this one? Does it say what kind it is? What the style is? No, I'll link it down below though. But we got it. I sent it, I told him about it on the Black Friday sale. So everything was half price. So he got bra and pants. That The bra matches this um, for the price of the bra normally. So that was really cool. So he's going to hopefully be able to exchange that because it just doesn't fit. It's too big. And then, these next things, I was not, not expecting these. I like thought that was done, but he was naughty. Look, it's a Huda palette. Let me get out of this. It's the Amethyst Obsessions. Get out, come on. Oh my goodness, it does not want to come out of its little plastic prison. It's the Huda Amethyst. Look at that, look at that middle. Like, I haven't even touched these yet. I'm, I'm going to just touch it now. Oh, my goodness. It's so... Wow. Wow! That is so pretty. It's, like, reflective, but it's got glit micro glitter in it as well. That's so pretty. Um, And the way he chose this and the other bit, I asked him if he had his sister's help because his sister loves makeup as much as me. No! football forum he has a football forum that he goes on and there was a thread about what to get your missus and there was like links to things and this and the next thing were on it so this is the last thing and it is again it's huda and it's a lip pencil and a mini liquid lipstick and lip gloss and look at this how gorgeous are those colors so i've got a liquid matte which is in the color cheerleader So pretty. That's the liquid mat. There's the dog. And then the gloss 
is metallic and it is called saucy and it is beautiful look so the matte and then that's the gloss like i just i can't actually believe it it's, i was not expecting that at all yeah he chose them via a football forum, forum which i thought was really funny um and it's got a really cool tin as well so those were my presents from bender the next thing i'm going to show you is from ben's auntie now we we feel really bad because like three days before christmas we decided that for boxing day rather than just having ben's parents my parents my brother and his missus and my uncle who was planning i decided that i'd just invite all of ben's aunties and uncles and ben ben's mum is one of four so there's three sets of aunties and uncles and i texted them and said if you want to come we'd love to see you thinking that they might have plans but they didn't and they all came and it was amazing it was so we had so much fun we played cards against humanity we played cranium and it was lush it was like the first time we think in three and a half years three quick no three yeah three christmases because i think 2015 um ben's amazing nanny grandma she died like four days before christmas and it was just horrible it was so so sad um ari was only like six or seven weeks old she was tiny and that was the last christmas we were all together we all made an effort and got together that year and then since then we just haven't and i kind of like maybe felt just because grandma wasn't here that we weren't all getting together and i just decided it would be lovely and so i invited them they all came and it was awesome however we didn't get anyone presents because we spent all of our money on the food <laughs> for boxing day because we did like a massive spread for everybody and got drink and stuff but ben's one of Ben's aunties bought presents for us. Um, she got me this mug. She got the girls' presents as well, just like lovely. And she got me this mug, which has got a bunny on it. And it says, happy days. You can't see the happy days because it's white, but it's got a bunny on it. It's so cute. And then she got this for Ben that I've stolen. It says, yippee ki -yay, motherfucker. And if you don't know what film that's from, then we can't be friends. Well, we can be friends, but you're going to have to watch it first. It's from Die Hard. You need to just go and watch Die Hard because your life will be better once you've watched it um, and this is from the recursive girl embroidery it's on the back it says who it is but I'll try and link it down below how amazing is that I love it I'm gonna put this so when you come into my house this is the first thing that you see because I feel like it sums up I'm gonna put it next to it. I've got a big skull in the hallway I'm gonna put this right next to it because I feel like it just sums us up it's perfect for me and Ben this is a bit of a random mix so it's just gonna be as i grab things so my mum got me this which is from next i think and it is a fake plant because our bathrooms have no windows none of them do they're all just dark nice little caves and i wanted plants in my upstairs bathroom to brighten it up but i didn't want to kill them all so she got me this and it's perfect this is going to go on um the dresser in the bathroom i love it then We've got some coasters that mum got me, which are amazing. She says she got these off Amazon, so I'll try and link these as well. There's four in a set and they're wooden. They're all the same. How cool are they? I like skulls, if you didn't know. This is your first time here. I'm obsessed with skulls. Um, I have skull tattoos and I have skulls all over my house. Um, but yeah, I love them. They're amazing. Ben's mum and dad... They, Ben's parents gave us some money and they got me uh, some nail files and they got me an awesome little planter but it's already in the garden and I can't lift it up it's too heavy but they got me this as well which says life is all rainbows and unicorns and it's these little like bulldog clips and then you can clip photos or lists to them so this is going to go on the wall in here somewhere I think but I'm not sure where but you can just clip pretty things on the bottom uh, my brother and amy this is amazing this is lucy's face shit and it is a makeup bag and one of their friends made this um it's called heartfelt and her etsy oh it says share your personalized item on instagram and get 10 percent off your first order that's nice heartfelt london i'll put it on the screen and link it all down below but yeah how cool is that absolutely love it so that is my new makeup bag lucy's face shit i just think it's really really cool um and it's the perfect size it's not too big it's not too small and yeah i'll link it all for you 
because once it's opened it's like a really nice big bag look that you can see perfect i just love it it's just awesome um is there anything else there let me see no we're gonna move on to stuff down here i had to grab something that mum got she got this for me but it's mostly for the girls and it is a grow your own unicorn she um i think she initially got it for the kids but then it says you have to be over 10 because it's got chemicals in it so she said i can have it but we're gonna let me and the girls are gonna do it later and it's basically i think i used to have these when i was little and you stand it up and then it grows like this weird unicorn mold but i didn't i think mine was a christmas tree i vaguely remember having a christmas tree one when i was little but we're gonna do that later it looks really cool i do a video on it because it's fun uh, mum got me a dark chocolate orange that i've already eaten most of because there is only i love dark chocolate dark chocolate orange is like my favorite thing ever it's way day tomorrow and i'm pretty sure i've gained like 47 pounds 50 pounds in three days because i've just eaten cheese and junk food and had all the alcohol but it's just it's fine i'm over it now next thing mum got me which i can't believe she actually bought because she doesn't swear she got me this mug and if you say it, for fuck's sake, it's swearing. But it's not because it's a fox. But it's still swearing. And I just thought that was like so me. And she said she saw it and she just had to get it for me. So that was awesome. Let's just break stuff down. Next up, she got me this which again has got a skull on it and it is a jewellery box and it's absolutely gorgeous i love it got velvet inside and it's metal and like it literally couldn't be more me if it tried um, and i said i needed a new like if you are if you are new here then like just my whole office is just there's just skulls everywhere so yeah i love it what's up next she got me a bath bomb and it's just a bath fizz out. I don't know where this is from. Superdrug and it's got an L on it because I am Lucy. She got me this thing. I thought she was getting me because she asked me what makeup I wanted. And I said I wanted a new um, Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Mascara because it is my favourite mascara. Along with Too Faced Better Than Sex, they are like on par with each other. And, I, and she said she'd get me one. And we sort of looked online and we found on QVC they did like a duo one because she said she wanted one as well. And I opened it and it said it was from Tarte because it had all the paper and I was like, that's the wrong shape for a mascara. She got me this. And it is a pineapple. It's called the High Performance Naturals and it is a pineapple palette, which I will show you. But inside you get a Lights, Camera, Lashes mascara. You get a Lights, Camera, Lashes. You get a Sex Kitten, which is the cutest eyeliner because it's got a little cat head on it. And then you get a, what is this, a lip quench, which just smells amazing. And then you get the palette as well, which I will show you. It's a freaking pineapple. It's a golden pineapple. And I love golden pineapple. Again, I've got, I've got a golden pineapple, like, just there as a mirror. I just love them. She knows me so well. So that's that. And then inside, it's gorgeous. Look so you've got like a highlighter and blush side and then let me take this plastic off get off oh it doesn't come off but that's quite clever look it's actually built in and tart stuff smells incredible and then my main present from mum which is my last presents was a slow cooker cookbook because i love cooking absolutely love cooking and cookery books i'm obsessed i've got so many and i love like retro ones from the 70s with recipes in that you will never ever make like green blancmange and stuff it looks disgusting but i just love to have the books to show me that which goes with my main present which i'll see if i can lift it is a new slow cooker and it's ginormous because i've been using mum's slow cooker from the 1970s for oh like i don't know for as long as i can remember but a section in the middle just burns every time because it's so old so she got me my own one which is amazing so that was my very long very out of focus come on oh there we go 
I see it. I'm really sorry how long this video was, but I hope you liked it. Please do let me know your favourite Christmas present that you got this year. Um, what was your favourite thing you gave as well? I was really happy. I got my mum... Um, she thought, I, when I was with her, I bought this face cream that she wanted and she, she knew what she was getting and she thought that was her present. But then I got her a couple of other little bits as well and I got her a new MAC lipstick and she was really excited about that. And I think, what did I get Ben? Oh God, with Ben, the last present he opened, I was like, what is it? And I couldn't remember what it was. And then he opened it and it was his Arsenal shirt and so it was his main present and I'd just forgotten they'd give it to him and he wasn't expecting that. So that was really cool. I think my favourite thing I got him, which is in my vlog, was a yard of chorizo. So yeah, most random and most favourite present was a yard of chorizo. Um, oh, and we got Ben's parents. We got them respective presents on their own. Like we got Ben's mum. What did we get Jane? Oh, we got her a really nice big canvas of um, all of us on holiday. And then we got his dad some beer and a book and bits. But then we got, it's kind of for all of us, uh, in I think January or february we're doing a murder mystery tour and it's like all of us so us two and the kids and ben's parents we're all going on murder mystery day yeah i'm excited so sorry this was long happy christmas happy new year happy everything 2019 is gonna be awesome i'll see you soon